Hey guys, this is Exile, and uh, I'm going to be playing some Arma 3. It's a really, really fun game. Uh, I personally like it more than Arma 2. I've had Arma 3 since it was like in alpha. And Arma 2 is really fun too. It's got a lot more guns and stuff. But, I mean, Arma 3 is just more efficient. The computer guys are really smart. Um... It runs faster, even though it's got better graphics. Just Arma 2 is really buggy. All sorts of stuff. And it's got ragdoll dead by, so it's fun. Anyways, I'm going to be trying Escape Stratus. Uh, I used to play this with some friends. And we never escaped. But I turned down the difficulty a little bit, at least for the first try, because I don't want to get wasted. And... I honestly have not played Arma 3 in at least a month and a half. I'm probably going to get owned. And it's only me. So I don't even have a buddy to back me up. Oh, I didn't even explain what Escape Stratus is. Basically, it's um, a port of Escape Chernaris, which is basically what you have to do is you're a prisoner of war. And it's completely random, so, um, where's the guy? You're basically a prisoner of war in this little container with guards patrolling outside, and you got one guy in here, and he has, like, a heart attack or something, I don't know, he just goes down, and then you take his gear and you have to escape, and then computer guys hunt you across the thing and you have to, like, get to, uh, camp, steal a map, find an extraction point where, like, American guys come in and save you, and it's, it's pretty epic, and it's all dynamic, so you spawn in a different place every time, um, the patrols are all completely dynamic, oh, Johnny's down, uh, so yeah, you never play the same game twice, you'll never start in the same spot, you'll never, uh, take his ammo, that gets, I keep shift clicking, Bad guys are going to start shooting me. Oh, that's great. Toolkit. Actually, I'm going to take his whole backpack. Um, this game has so many stances, too. Let's flip to full auto. Now, I don't know where these guys are. It's kind of worrying. Oh, there's one. Now this is bad. They will send helicopters after you, they will send tanks after you, they will send practically everything after you. Now I think there's more guys. There's probably... third person. Yeah, there's a guy. Wonderful. Nobody out here. It's kind of cheating, but okay. This is not good. Oh yeah, time of day, everything's random. What? How was that fool not dead? I haven't played armor in way too long. This game's really hardcore. It's like two bullets and you're dead. And you have to count for bullet drop and... There we go. That's right. Oh! I lost. That was bad. No medic nearby. Okay, well, at least we started to get the hang of it. Let's try that again. I got used to this. Wish it didn't have this little startup thing. In the beginning, every time, kind of sucks. You have to wait for it, but it's kind of good because it spawns everything in while this is happening, so it's not glitchy in the beginning. And this is just one of the maps. But for those of you unfamiliar with Arma, it's a really cool game. It's like a military simulator. It's like open world. You can make your own missions. Why am I walking sideways? Okay. 
always salute. Ooh, this is a cool spot. I always salute this guy. And he's down. Now what we're going to do, is I'm going to actually, since I don't want to wait for this to save every time, and I like this area, I'm going to save. This is cheating, but I'm a cheater. Alright, now we'll spawn right here every time, so I don't have to wait for it to load. Inventory. The controls in this game are horrendous. Night vision goggles could come in handy if it gets nighttime. Ah, uh, stun eggs. Don't care about smokes. Well, I'm just going to take the whole backpack. Alright. Hit C, so that... Oops, wrong button. Now we can toggle so we can always have our gun up, so that's kind of what we want in the beginning. If they see me with the gun in here, they're going to kill me. So let's see. There's a guy up there. And I believe they can shoot through the fence. Actually, let's see if we can do this. Toss a grenade. Ooh. Yeah, I got one! This guy's done. Ah, oh, he's too high. Can't see him. I can actually stand up taller. It's as tall as I can go. Let's try shooting. Man. These guys are too far away. If, it, the problem is you gotta get out of here fast, because if you don't, then the choppers show up. Let's get this fool. Reload. Really? I actually like this pistol. Let's try this. It's much more powerful. You can like one shot people if you hit them in the head. Let's open this door. Wrong door. There's so many stances in this game. You can even sit down and scoot around. And lay down cycle through all of them. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm just going to make a run for it because the chopper's coming. But if the chopper sees you, it just it just spots you the rest of the game pretty much unless you can ditch it. And then you the guys always know where you are. There's probably an APC on the way, so pull out my rifle again. This thing's actually pretty good. You gotta keep it on single shot though if you want to get accurate. And I only got four mags. Normally, when you got teammates and stuff, you can do this with like ten people, and you can get a lot more gear. So I don't. So I got a decision to make. I can either hide and hunt these guys. Whoa! What? That must have been a grenade launcher. I'm just gonna book it for a city. Sometimes there's civilians driving by. You can take their cars. The problem is if you kill a civilian, they like turn on you and then they report you whenever they see you. You can ride in their car sometimes. Whoa! That was an APC. I definitely didn't see that, but at least we saved right here. So let's just do continue. Okay. Should load us up right where we were. It always does this weird bug where sometimes if you're sprinting when you when it ends, you stay sprinting. Alright. Inventory. Take all stuff again. Night vision. Yeah, first aids for healing yourself, essentially. Aids. Rounds. First time I played this, I didn't know that that guy was going to die. I watched him, and he, sometimes they don't die for a while. And it took him like 45 seconds. And I didn't know he was going to die, so I was like, well, what am I supposed to do? So I just opened the door and ran for my life. And I figured I just had to get out as fast as possible, so like, I waited for the guards to move and everything, and I ran. I got in like a bunch of trees and they were all chasing me with guns and then I realized I had no way to kill anyone 
and then I could never get a gun. So I just ran for like 30 minutes with helicopters and cars chasing me before they finally killed me. gonna actually have surprisingly little recoil compared to the other guns. Somebody back there. He's gonna come around. See him. Ooh. Right. Love this pistol. Now I gotta get out of here. This last time, the APC came and killed me. Let's see if I can get this guy with the pistol. It's 45. It does a lot more damage than the other ones. Got that guy. I'm a pistol sniper. Oh, you gotta be. S can't be serious. There's like a. That guy's locked in walking mode. Did I get shot in the leg? No, there's like a butt. Oh! oh that's bad! Oh, I am so dead. Get him? You need to throw a grenade at me? Oh, really? A chopper? An APC, really? Oh, this is a bad day. No, yeah, I was done. Okay. <sighs> this is a horrible... Okay, new plan. I am just going to literally book it out of there and run for my life. Because staying to kill these guys just takes way too long. And I might be able to get out of there. Let's give it a shot at least. Should have saved after I picked this guy's stuff up. So dead. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Why am I stuck in this? I gotta look at the controls. Can I hit this guy through here? I don't think so. This guy, though. <laughs> plan's not going so great. Oh! Hit the wrong button!
Take a grenade! Oh, now I gotta get aim out. Oh, come on, run up the hill. Oh, rearm it, auto rifle. Just rearm with this guy real fast. We gotta get out of here. I'm probably gonna lose. What was that? Serpentine! I accidentally hit one of the buttons that locks your uh, walking, and there's a button that undoes it, and I forget what it is. Oh! And I can't pause this. APCs. Gotta get into the trees. Whoa, there's guys over there. What is happening? Guys, so tired. Come on, come on, move, 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 man. Really? This is it? This is Max? This is Max? Oh my. That's ridiculous. Let's see the controls. Sprint toggle. Oh, that's not what I want. I want a. There's one called toggle. Combat pace toggle. Let's see, okay, I know that one. Primary mouse button. Oh. Oh, W and S. That's it. Walk around toggle. See if you accidentally hit them both at the same time. Alright, let's try a different one. I don't want to load that up again. Uh, back. Restart. That place I'm starting at is not as good as I expected. Here's the parameters real fast. Grass, well, no grass. They can't, they can still see through the grass anyway, so it just makes it harder for me. Make it medium. A few. We'll make these guys easy. I'm still losing, so. Uh, I think everything else is good. Let's try it. Oh, this is so bad. This place seems good. Actually, could be bad. I'll save it right after this. I get all this guy's gear, though. Oh, he's got the hat! He's got the hat! Okay. I got the aviators. Now, you don't understand. The hat! That will allow me to win. Come on, man. Get it over with, Johnny! Johnny was a good man. Now I'm taking your guns. Oh, man. The inventory in this game is so weird. Depending on where you're standing, you might not get the same stuff. I'm gonna take the hat, night vision goggles. It sucks he doesn't have a backpack. On white smoke grenades. Now we're gonna save. I actually climb in under that, but I Whoa! There 
There we go. What? There's like a tank out there already! How's that fair? Drop that guy. We want to get... What?! Are you serious?! No. That is stupid. I'm gonna have to get someone else to play this game with me. Now what is this thing driving by? Let me get this guy with the Oh! Oh! What? I really hate this game right now. This is nothing like The Great Escape. I feel horrible right now. I'm like uneasy and I still suck. I used to be really good at this game actually. Can we do it? Oh! Oh! Ah! You! So you get. Oh! Oh! I am a foot hunter! Where is everyone shooting at me from? Oh! There's another guy right there. Die! don't like your knee. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't like this. What? Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, he just blew himself up. Fine by me. Got him. Ah, loser. Rearm, get some more ammo. Oh, perfect. Oh, can't fit. Whoa! Whoa! Spray and pray. Works every time. Man, now the grenade launcher. Oh! Oh! Where is this game? never really want to stay near a road because that's where the APCs drive. <laughs> Maybe up there there might be a... So now here's the problem. I'm going into a ditch. You're gonna be able to shoot down on me. But I got the hat. So that could potentially allow me to live. If any of you guys have this game, like, let me know. Maybe we can play some escape, uh, Stratus. I shouldn't even call this like a let's play, this should be more like a let's fail. This is just horrible. I'm probably gonna get just sniped in the head. These pewter guys, they're really smart too, they like radio to each other and like flank you, so like if you're engaging some group of guys, they'll send some of their squad guys to go off on the sides and come up behind you and stuff, it's, and they use cover really well. They're really, really smart. 
and like the chopper, especially in this one, the guy's like done all sorts of scripting to make make like there's literally like a computer general who will move all his units around the map, like as if he was a player. It's pretty cool. When did they add this? Normally you could still walk full speed. Let's take a little break. Take a little breather. This guy's uh. Seeming a little winded. Sure, there's gonna be dudes coming down here. Let's see what my settings are at for graphics while we wait. Mm, view distance. Overall, let's turn that up a little bit. See dudes farther away. Mm, when is it caustic? Sounds cool. Eh. I like to get 60 frames per second, so I don't want to turn up stuff too much because sometimes when stuff gets crazy. All right, let's go. That's the other thing. Like, if you try to hike straight up, you can't. You have to take it at an angle, just like in real life, essentially. Now, here's the problem. I don't think the chopper spotted me, which means they will start just sending out patrols, just combing the area. So, I gotta be careful. I don't walk into any coming from my sides, coming from right in front of me, coming from left. Just chopper. And I'm sure there's some coming from behind me, because they know which direction I went. Yeah, if you play Call of Duty, you probably would not like this game. Because it actually takes skill. I mean... Like, real skill. Like, if you're a sniper in this game, you literally have to calculate drop, you have to sight in your scope, you have to hold it steady, you have to calculate bullet travel time, I mean, it takes a l I mean, I am a horrible sniper, but I'm like a, a beast of a sniper in Call of Duty or Battlefield or whatever, but I mean, it's a totally different game, it's a simulator, it's not a arcade shooter. And the multiplayer in this game, as you can imagine, is pretty crazy. When you get, like, battles on maps this size, and you and your squad are walking through the forest, and then you get ambushed by, like, five different squads from posing mountains and stuff. It's kind of cool. People flying over in choppers. And this is a new feature, because they never used to make it so your guy walked this slow. Like, you could always sprint forever. He would just sprint really slow. It's the other thing. He gets fatigued, and then you're... Look at your gun wobbling. Just a little breather again, buddy. This guy can't even crawl. Then again, I can't blame him. He just climbed up a mountain. And ran from like a million guys. What's that? binoculars. Yeah, when you playing this mode with a group of friends is really fun. We're running around, hide man trees, having people cover each other. Alright, we good to go, buddy? Let's just take it slow. No clue where I am. I've played this map. I mean this is like one of two maps. Uh oh, chopper. They seem to be looking for me over in that general area. The problem is the dudes don't make a whole lot of noise. So you gotta keep an eye out. And they always wear camo, so they blend in good. They've gotten ambushed many a times. Road. 
this is either good or bad. So you know, I can follow the road. Most likely, a tank is going to drive up it. Which way do I go? Good idea. I'll just hug the road. I'll always be able to dive off this left side if I get hit. This guy's got pretty good uh, stamina regen. Hiked up like three mountains. He just takes a little breather and he's good to go. down enemies so much that's why I haven't seen any. Normally I play this on medium. You see enemies like everywhere. Like every time you turn that up there's more dudes covering your little spawn thing. It's even harder. That's where I want to be. Come on. It's a long hike. So that's the thing. Now I need to find bad guys so that I can kill them. There's somebody. Saw it. White thing. Looks like a civilian, probably. Car down there. Can't tell if it's military. That's part of the problem. You see something, you'll be like, hey, I see a car. Is it a car that's going to shoot me? I mean, I had one time, and the night, when it, sometimes it's night, and it's insane. Like, you'll be hiding behind a tree with guys with flashlights shining around looking for you. Just praying you, they don't have night vision, because sometimes they don't. And you got, like, lasers on your guns and stuff. And, like, one time there was a car, like a Humvee-looking thing, with a 50 cal machine gun on it. And my buddy ran out, and we, we were just walking through this dark field, basically. And he just walks past a tree and gets just wasted by this thing. Like this 50 caliber bullet just rips through him, takes him out. He's laying on the ground, bleeding out. So I dive in a rock and I see like a Humvee headlights on, slowly going like three miles an hour, with like six dudes on each side of it in like a delta formation, just combing through the plains. And I was just hiding in a rock and they went right past me. And then like one guy happened to look. Oh, military transport. One guy happened to look over, and then it was just—it was just like an execution. But it was intense. I'm really not digging the slow walk. This guy needs to exercise more or something. Can't wait for GTA to come out for a PC. That'll be pretty sweet. Except they delayed it. All right, man, you good? Let's go. Ooh, that was a tank. That was definitely just a tank. So now, sometimes what you can do is you get landmines and you place them out here and wait. They have no clue where I am, which is good. I think things, I think things are about to heat up a little bit.
looks like some sort of guard outpost over there. Looks like a car. Basically, if I get stuck with a tank, civilian. So normally there's grass all over these hills, but like when you're in this mode, you can't see anything. It's just blades of grass, and you have to push them down. Like as you climb over them, it mats them down. But the computer guys, for some reason, are not allowed to see right through them, so it doesn't even hide you. It just hinders you. So I just turn them off, get better FPS, and uh, it's way easier. This guy needs to catch his breath! Uh oh. I think that's guys. That's definitely a patrol. Okay, this could be good though. If I can hit these guys from behind. In fact, I'm, I'm gonna take him out. Okay, that's definitely a car. Let's try this. Come on, really? What the heck is that? What? Run away! That was horrible, man. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode for today because I'm just doing horrible. But, I'll be back. Hopefully. Better. That'd be cool. Uh, if you liked it, like and subscribe and whatever. If you didn't like it, you're a terrible person. And that is that. Goodbye.